happy holidays folks and welcome back to our channel. My name is Rob and this is Old Birdling. Unbelievable. Yes, we are still at Loudoun's and today uh, Storm Kathleen's hitting. I think we're, we're going to be okay because we're like... No, nah, we'll be fine. Not on the west coast. Absolutely fine. But I hope everybody that's on the west coast is uh, survived it's okay. It's yeah, but uh, we are parked there Very and late. we have got a fantastic view of the beautiful vans. Extra stock because they've got no more room over actually at the place. So. Yeah, all these are waiting to go into the showroom and onto the forecourt for sale, I suppose. But uh, we like this one here, the sunlight. We do. We do. And I've because I can't get them because obviously they're locked. But I'm sure they'll have one over there. The sunlight has got exactly the same layout as the Malibu over here. But obviously that one costs a lot more money than that one. But the layout is basically the same. Obviously, you're paying a lot more for the name up there. Yeah, because that's Cathargo. Who makes sunlight? I thought, isn't Deathless? Deathless yeah. makes sunlight. I think, I think it's Deathless, yeah. Not sure, but it's maybe. I'm going to have a look. Do, 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 do. Yeah, yeah. This is a bit uh, water, waterlogged here. Hang on a sec. I don't know what it is. It's definitely a sunlight, but I don't, I don't know who makes it. Do you? What? I'll find those. Yeah, so you've got the sunlight in the A class, and you've also got one next door with just the uh, coach build. There you go. Nice Ooh, van. Yes. Very nice van. Right, so we're going to go in. What? We're going to go up there and have a look and maybe get a coffee. It's a bit windy, isn't it? I don't know why we bother doing my hair. Hang on, you're not you're not having a coffee. We just had one in there. I might have another one. Nah. Yeah, there's a few vans turned up as well for this little rally. Yeah, not so sure on the six meter rule. No, yeah, six meter rule's gone out the window. That's a good idea as well at Loudoun's. If you buy a van from here, then you can come for the night and stop on those pitches there so you can uh, try them out yes make sure everything's okay and working like you know so it doesn't take one night though does it, it took three it was three and a half years yeah it takes yeah, it takes longer than one night to find out the faults in your van we'll just have a quick look in this vw california uh price is my assistant to go and have a look Nine, eight, yeah. 90,000. 90 grand. How old is it? Brand new. No, it's not brand new, is it? 72 blades. It's a bit clinical in here, folks. I'm not keen, it's too clinical. You've got your bed there. Loads of, loads of room under there to put things. Yeah, very clinical. I don't know, I'm not sure. So what's above the driver? What's up there? That's another bed. Oh, is it? Is it? I presume, yeah, it's a bed. Yeah, up there. And you've got a skylight there. It's very modern. Very, very modern. Mm. Maybe a bit too modern for us. Well, we're old. Loads of headroom, because it's the, the high line. Yeah, what's in here? Oh, you've got your wet room there, look. Nice one. I do like it that it's got the uh, built-in fly screen. Yes. So that one comes to there and then that yeah. one comes to there. That one comes to there, look like that. And then that one comes across there, which is a fantastic idea to keep the little bugs out like Lynn. What did you just say? Well, she just come out with some no, stuff, you know. ladies will understand. It's like when you go into one of those uh, portable hospital units on the car parks, like when you go for a mammogram. It reminded me of that. You're a strange little person. Shut up, Robert. We are now inside the Swift Carrera. Swift Carrera. 132. 132. Beautiful van. A couple of friends of ours, Amber and Pete. This is their van they are purchasing. Well, next year. Next year, yeah. Lovely van. Lovely seating area. Plenty of space. The storage under there and the storage under there. Six units there. Yeah. How's that work? Oh, there you go. Little, yeah, quite deep. Uh, 
feel like I'm in an aeroplane doing the air hostess and the S Actually, that's what it there. reminds me of. <laughs> that's what it reminds me of, seriously. But, uh, and these are the overhead lockers for the Yeah, airplane. and you've got a, a skylight at the back there. Windows in the back door. Plenty of light, airy. You've got storage there. And here. Cracking little kitchen area. To me, that's the only thing that lets these vans down. The sink is ridiculously sore. Yeah. Uh, cupboard there. What's that? I feel that's, I don't know what that is. You empty your fresh or empty your Oh waste. yeah, fresh and waste, yeah. Watch your head. And then you've got your TV point in there and whatever. Cracking wet room. That's a clever idea, isn't it? Yeah. And there's your sink lock. Very smart. You'd probably be able to wash up better in that sink. I'll be able to get you in that. Shut up, Robert. Get your armbands out, chuck you in. Cracking little fridge, which is the same kind of design as ours with a freezer. There you go. So this opens both ways, I presume. In a sec. Yes. Uh oh. <laughs> Hold the camera, pull the door off. Putting the door back on. There you go. I'll fix it. Oh, the bloody door fell off. It's not on properly. No. Yeah, no, but I'll have to sort it out. I don't trust it anymore. It was a bit, I think it, it wasn't on. It's right. on there anyway, so it can't fall off. No. <laughs> bloody hell, man, looking at the van, I'm, I'm, I'm wrecking it. Yeah, it is really is a cracking van. 72,500, but it is manual. Yes. Me, I'd go for the auto. Which Amber and Peter? Yes. Let's have a look at the cab, a quick look at the cab. Don't touch anything. There you go, standard for your cab with your sat nav on and whatever. Lovely skylight there. And one there. Cupboards here. Which is great. Those are just blanks. But yeah, cracking van, isn't it? And you've also got here. Another cupboard, more storage there, and you've got something there. <laughs> oh yeah, I think your bin, your bin is in there. I'm not going to touch anything else though because it drops apart when I touch things. <sighs> Very nice. It could do with a fly net across here. Yes, that would be a good idea to put a fly net across the back the part. Like angels said. There's the one on here. Yes. Yeah. Fly net on there, which is a good idea. Don't you touch it. I won't. It's beautiful, isn't it? Yeah. It really is a nice, nice panel van. Stunning. Airy, spacious. Love it. Apps. Let's buy this. No. What the hell? Are you sure? Yes, 100%. Okay. It's very nice. Lighting all the way around. Beautiful van. So the one that's parked by where we are parked over there is the Sunlight 168 that we just showed you. And there's actually one in here that's open, brand new. So let's go and have a look inside. There it is. So it's, it's basically the, the same cab as ours, Fiat Ducato. Yeah, but they're just built over it. face lift like on it. Yeah, that's plastic, plastic all over it. Nice big garage. Yes. That's what I like about, that's what attracted me to it. Well, yeah, because the cab, the bit at the front, makes it look feel massive when you walk in it. It really does. I, I do like, I do really like the, the look of the A-Class, but what use is all that space on the dash. I mean, I know like uh, Tash, like Life Beyond Bricks, they're full-time motorhomers and their cats sleeping on there. Well, I could put a little mattress and you could sleep on there. There is that, but... No, it is a nice van. It's You've got a, a drop, beautiful van. A drop-down bed there, which is perfect. Massive lockers, and I mean massive. Oh, please don't touch them. Well, they're cut into two, but they are big. Yeah cooking area, not much workspace, but you've got it, you know, it's one of them, isn't it? And you've got your two burners there, and a little oven come grill there, is it? And the tiny little sink. 
it's bigger than the one in the... Yeah, well this is a, a motorhome. A massive fridge, I think. Can you open the fridge? Do you want me to do it? No, there's the freezer. I can't open the fridge because the doors fall off and I do it. With the fridge. Big freezer. No microwave. So that would do you, would it? Now you're into your microwave meals. Massive cupboard up there. Just controls there. Trim, uh, trim heating. And then, I goes. can't walk back. Big drawer there. Cutting and a cupboard drawer. under there. And then, to get into the bedroom, you've got steps into bed with shelving there yeah i like it to be honest the one thing that i've never seen before maybe <coughs> just for me what is the floor you take that bit of the flooring out that bit there yeah yeah and then for the shower so Let's have a look. this this will lift out Oh yeah, and then you can shut your shower, so you, it's not yeah. make it doesn't it makes it less claustrophobic. Yes, but well, you know, the A class is as I said before the space. It, it just gives you that feeling of masses of space. What's in that toilet? <sighs> so that means. Oh yeah, there you go. There's your toilet. If you sink. Cupboards, skylight, massive mirror. Yeah, I do like it. I like it a lot. And I presume that pulls out like that to make your double bed. Very nice. Very nice van indeed. I like this. There's no price on this one. There is over there a Malibu, Cathargo Malibu, £115,137. Can I have a look down from this one, please? Yes. So you've got a seat there, travel seats. I think that's a travel seat as well, I'm not sure. Massive, massive room on the front, because it's an A class. Massive windows. That's, oh, it's just awesome. I like it. I really do like it. You didn't use, back in the day, you didn't like the A-class, did you? No, I didn't. But they, over the years, well, since I've been into motorhome, they really have grown me. This is a beautiful van. It's got the uh, auto gearbox. Yeah, it's, yeah, it's a nice van. It's a lovely The first van. thing I'll do, though, folks, is get rid of those curtains. And the door's just shut on us. That's it. you got to buy it. Beautiful. Yeah, very nice fan. If you've got one of these, anybody out there, you're no. very lucky. Yeah, but there's no price. And if you go onto Loudon's price list online, it says not, price not available. Please come in store and ask. I think they're about 90 grand, I think. I 85, think. 90 grand, something yeah. like that. Which, you know, today's price isn't too bad, really, is it? I know it's still a lot of money, but you know what I mean. Yeah, you're talking like it's pounds, yeah. not thousands. Yes. Let's go I and like have a look it. in the Malibu. Yeah. That's going to cost you a few quid if that breaks, that windscreen. Oh, gosh, yes. Yes. You're looking really pretty. Shut up, Robert. Okay. Great table. Yeah, I would really do like this one. Well, unfortunately, we can't take you into the Malibus because they're all locked. But like I said yesterday, when you're talking in vans way over a hundred thousand, then you can... They've got to be cautious, I suppose. Yeah. You know, things go missing this day and age, unfortunately. They do. Do you want to have a look in this one? We can't get in at the moment because somebody's in the van next to it and the doors are opening... What? ...side by side. The door's there? No, that's not the door. They have doors over there. Is it? Walk on the other side, you can get in. Do, 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 do. Yes, they are growing on me. These probably because of the garages are massive. What? I've never seen so many contiques. When we were really looking for one, couldn't find one, and they are everywhere. Yeah, swift, everywhere. There you go. Great little touch there, look. 
Is that to put your umbrella? Is that to hang your coat on? I think it is. Back there. I don't know. Well? How old is this one? I don't know. I think it was a 19, wasn't it? It's Fixed good. bedroom. It's been very well looked after. Yeah. Very spacious. There's a lot more space in this for the bedroom than ours. A lot more. There's your show with the same idea again with the floor. Not much workspace. It's been very well looked after. If it is it a has. 19. It is a 19. I thought it was. Yeah. Massive storage. I mean, it's like, it's just huge, isn't it? Yeah. I've been in a spaceship. Shut up, Lee. Oh, step there. Yeah, there's a step there. And a step there. And there's also a step there. Yeah, it's a nice fan. It is a very nice fan. I just love the, love the A classes now because of the space. I don't want to bang on about it too much. Then but you will. I will. Nice seats. Masses of room there. Shelving and cupboards in there, storage. Very nice fan. Uh oh, she's gone. Thank God for that. Can I have a rest? Oh, right, I've took the camera off him to show you the bathroom. So there you go. So, whoops, that's the thing that Robert didn't put down or somebody didn't. So you've got the shower, the same principle, and you can shut it all off and have your own private bathroom. So, yeah. Oh, apart from that's gone mouldy, that needs doing. What do you think? I don't know, I'm just sat here. I don't think you'd, you'd be that comfortable, to be honest. There's nowhere to lounge, is there? Yeah, there's nowhere. Well, gone as you can put your feet up, can't you? Because mm, you've got the bench seats. Compromises. Drop down bed. It is a nice van. Nobody, nobody can say it's not a nice van because it is. But you know, you've got to picture yourself in these vans, haven't you? Yeah. And it is lovely to travel. I mean, you can turn the captain's chairs around and you've got an entertaining area, but nowhere to lounge. Mm. Yes, it is a 19 plate. Carrado. Never heard of this make. Oh look, the village idiot. So we are trying to keep away from Swifts, even though there are lots and lots of Swifts here. But we, we, we always t tend to, to veer towards the, uh, the Swift vans. So this is the Chasson. No plate on it, no information on it. Brand new. Brand new. It is the 550X. Yeah. I do like the look of this, to be honest. Exclusive line. Let's have a look at the back of it. Matte black wheels. Very modern looking back. But you roll out there. It's only a short van. It is £80,460. Wow, that's a lot of money. It's The length is 5.99 metres, width 2 metres 10, height 2.75. Um, MTPLM is 3,500 kilos. So you've only got 640 kilos of pay payload. Go on, put you in, you won't get much else in. Uh, but you, I'm not sure. I just look for the rest of it. I know it's a short van. Yeah, I I like things that look a bit different than this, this does. This is, yes. Uh, even the panelling on the door, you know. Let's have a look inside. I'm not sure what you're going to think. Let's have a look. Oh, do, do, do. Well. Here's your little shower look, little wet room, loads of mirrors and cupboards and your skylight. Let me just see what's in here. Don't touch. Oh that's all your, I don't know what it is, all your bumkum. Uh, your cooker, not much room in here, width. And your sink, cupboards. And a skylight there, and a drop down bed. I, like, I do like the X everywhere, it's very good. And yes. the X is on there, and you've got the X on there. I'm sure we've been in one of these before. I think so, it's, it looks... Uh... Cracking table. Masses of light. What is it? It's a Fiat, isn't it? Yeah. Fiat blue and grey seats. A skylight up there. Yes, I like it. I think it's nice. I think it's. I wonder if the sweets, the sweets, the seats swivel. Don't know. Maybe I don't know. 
I just love the uh, the black surround on the windows. Yeah, very modern, but I think better yeah. than the white. Hey? It's very modern, but I think it's better than the white on the yes. redub that we I th saw. I think it goes really well, the colours do, yeah. really well indeed. And you've even got things to put the keys in and whatever. Yeah, it's a very nice fan. Very nice fan. But it's 80, 80 and a half thousand, it should be. Yeah, that's a lot of money. And you definitely haven't got much room there to get through there. Unless that table goes back that way more. It probably does. It's yeah, don't it's mess a, around with it. It's an electric one. So. We're already, already home for a fridge door. Uh, who does? <laughs> Yeah, it's very nice. I can't believe how warm it is. It's 19 degrees, so and I'm walking about in the fleece. That's why I met the sensible, and I didn't put, even put my coat on today. The X550. Well, I like it anyway. Do you? Yes, I do. I wouldn't. I haven't seen a van yet that I'd say, yeah, let's do it. Have you? Yes. Which? The one we got out this morning. Now, this one we, we, were thought, we thought we'd show you because it's the same as ours. Well, it's Contiki Sport, probably a different layout. Uh, 20 plate. It's uh, £73,000. Now it's £73,000, so it's four years old. Is it four years old? Yeah. We paid... 64 I think it was for us brand new and this is 73 now wow there you go look hang on let me see something let me have a look yeah 150 this one's got 150 brake ours has got 160 brake this one's only done how many miles has it done 12,787 miles. Ours has done nearly 32, but we use ours, so there you go. Let's have a look. I've put one of these on, so maybe the people are elderly. It's got a big garage, so that means it's got a high bed. 597. I don't think it's as long as ours. I might be wrong, but I don't think it is. So we'll have a look inside. Well. Well, you've only got one area to lounge in because it's the travel seats. Yeah. Let's so have a look. Is it the lounge? It's classed as the lounge, is it? I don't know. Yeah, exactly the same seats as ours. Travel seats in the table, two captain's chairs. What's the matter, Liam? What are you looking at? Uh, just the mileage, 12,000. Cupboards are the same as ours, exactly. I think it's had a harder life, that, even though ours has done a lot more mileage. There's things on it that's... I had that impression, but, you know, it's one of them, isn't it? Yes. Uh, You're very precious over your van, our van, aren't you? That's exactly the same as ours. Worktop started to go, which is ours went. Yeah, the worktop's gone, waste. yeah. Uh, Mike's the same as ours. And then you've got to climb into bed. And you really have got to climb into bed. That's what I was looking at when I was over Wow, there. that's high, man. That, that is really high. Uh, you know, got windows both sides and a skylight to throw light in but yeah I'd struggle but you have got a big garage so that's why the bed's so high the shower exactly the same as ours it's the same van in it so it's gonna be and that is exactly the same as well yeah I know what I said we I just said we weren't gonna go in any swift but we wanted to just to uh, to see how, have you told them how much we paid for ours? 64 yes, and a yes. half. Oh, 64 and a half. Yeah. 64 and a half we paid for ours, yes. Yeah. Uh, this is shorter than our van, isn't it? That's one thing I was trying to look at on here. but it, Yeah, let's go out and have a look at it. It's bloody hot in here. It isn't on, I don't think. The, uh, the cab is exactly the same as ours. Yeah. Nice van for somebody, I suppose. I just can't get over the price. 
No, but that's what's happened, isn't it? Since we bought ours, we bought ours at the right time mm. before the uh, it yeah. went crazy. See, we could sell ours for more than we paid for it today. Okay. Well, this has just proved it. But you've still got to put a hell of a lot more money to get something better than the one you've already got. Oh, yeah. So is it really worth it? Um, yeah. You do, we've done a lot to ours, unless it was something that we both walked in and said yes. Yes. Because we just can't agree, can we? No. Maybe one day. Maybe not. Probably not. Bailey autograph, 71 plate, £72,995. Ultimate warranty, two years breakdown, moisture test, three overnight stays, two years, uh, oh, I said two years warranty. Yeah, habitation check, six months tax, forty pound of fuel, HPI check, on a Peugeot cab. Just gonna have a quick look inside. Lynn's already in. So you got a bike crack on the back. Now it's got provisions for the white crack. Very spacious. It feels more like a caravan because you've got so much space. So look. Watch all the stones. We yeah. said this last time we came. It's it's a shame because it's going to mark the floors. I'm trying not to yeah. tread on any. Yeah, I don't know. The people that haven't watched all our vlogs, we did a, a vlog at AMG. Is it AMG? In AEG in Starbridge. AEG in Starbridge. Mm. Best presented vans. Ever. We have ever seen on a showroom. Yeah. And we have been to some showrooms. So, you know, if you're in Starbridge area and you're passing, go in there because they dress the vans like, you know, to make it feel like you're there's somebody actually living in the co in them kind of thing. Yeah. But this, is it's, it's lovely. It's very yes. spacious. French bed. Mm, yes, we've had one of those, haven't we? And we didn't really get on with it in one of the caravans. Yeah, because you like climbing over me, didn't you? No, for some reason I, I end up by the window, which is the big long part, and then you ended up on the shorter part. Yeah. I just wish they'd do something with the mattresses when they put these up for sale, because that puts you off. Well, I think... Now, we might be a bit picky here, but I think when they when people are selling second-hand vans... They should put a new mattress they in. They should put a new mattress yeah. in. I, knew you, I thought you were going to say that. Chuck it away, put a new one in. Yeah. To me, that will make a big difference to buying a used van. Because yeah. that's the first thing we'd do anyway. If we bought a used van, we'd chuck the mattress out and buy another one. And I think it's very off-putting when you do look at the vans and the mattress is tatty. Yeah. And it's, it just puts a downer yeah. on it straight away. I mean, how much is a new mattress? Three, four hundred quid? Yeah. For what they're earning out of these vans, Yeah, sure. Put a new mattress in dealers. Listen to Rob and Lynn on tour. Put a new mattress in. OK. <laughs> Happy with that. Yeah, it is a very spacious van, though. It is. Look at your floor space. Yeah. I think it's... Uh, is it eight foot wide, this? It feels it, so I yeah. don't know, you've just read the spec. Yeah. It's on a Peugeot cab. How old is it? Uh, I did say. And you've forgotten. Well, it's on film, so. Massive cupboards. Plenty of storage. Microwave. Russell Hobbs. Big sink. There's your cooker. Not much workspace, though, to be honest. Because obviously, if you're using your cooker, where would you prepare your food? If you're using that cooker there. Yeah. You just put put one on here, don't you? Yeah. Lovely drawers. Uh oh, it's a bit dodgy. Don't touch anything, we keep breaking oh, things. We I like how you lump. I wouldn't do it. I wouldn't no, do it. <laughs> just leave it. Uh your fridge there, I'll do this carefully. Oh please don't. No, don't touch it, don't. No, no. Anyways, the fridge there. <laughs> Unbelievable. In here you have your Oh man, that's plenty of room in there, folks. Got a big shower, your toilet, and a sink there, and a big mirror. Yeah. Nice one. Place for Rob's wallet down there, look. What? Place for your wallet down there. Oh. Um, don't keep making it on tight. Well, yeah, I mean, that because I'd never get it. You've got your control panel up there. It's Truma, is it Truma, the, the Bailey? It's a lovely van. Yeah. If you, if you forget the mattress, yeah, it's a lovely van. Yeah. To be honest, if I I would tell the dealer if I was buying a used van, I'd say change the mattress and I'll have it. 
That's all I'd say. We did. We have done yet. That was at a caravan we bought, yes. It was a second-hand caravan. I said, if, if you put a, put a mattress in, then we'll buy it. Yeah. So, remember that, people. If you're going to buy something used, demand a new mattress. Well, however old this cooker is, this van is, sorry. It hasn't been used. Or they've put a new hot plate in. All our hot plates gone rusty. Yeah, and this has even gone rusty. We're looking at replacing it, but we don't. We're not sure on how. And it's our own fault. Yes. Which I, which I realised this morning, because the washing up mat that we use, we travel with it under there, sort of rattles underneath yeah. the cooker there. And one of the last things I do before we go, obviously, is wash the cups and the cereal bowls up, and then I'll put the mat in, which has caused the damp, which has caused that to rust. Yeah. So we have got to replace. The, the, hot, well, the hot plate. We're on about replacing the whole thing, aren't we? Well, the, not the cooker, just no, the plate. The, the top bit because yeah. we've lost enamel yeah. off it. I don't. It's. I've looked. I've looked online today, and they said uh, make sure a competent person does it. It's well, not, I do. No, it's not an easy job for somebody who's never done one before. No, it can't be that hard. But yeah, this cooker. It's never been used, or well, very, very light yeah. use. Very nice fan. Well, so that's the Bailey autograph. Yes, very nice for somebody. Very nice. 95 grand for an Airstream. Beautiful though, what I can see. Yeah. Let's have a look. Because of the music. There you go. Wow. This is the, we're in a caravan. We thought, we thought we'd end our vlog by doing a few caravans. This is the Bailey Alicanto Grand Evora. Was £39,644 and now it's £36,644, saving of £3,000. You can read, it's written on the window right by him. No, it's because I'm full of knowledge. No, it's not, it's because you've just looked at it when you've read it. It is lovely. Oh, yeah, I'll take him around then. Oh, what's the matter with your legs today? I'm tired. Right, we'll start in the bathroom. Let's start in the bathroom. Huge, huge shower. Could actually get two people in that. Don't get any ideas. <laughs> Let lovely big bathroom. Little cupboards. Perfect. Lovely area to do your makeup and get ready. And the bed. Another mirror. Nice loads, big lockers. Loads of storage. There is, isn't there? Yeah. That great caravans are on there. I'm, very, touch that fridge at all. I'm very careful with fridges. I'm very careful with everything. Not brute force like you. Lovely. L nice kitchen area. Love this. Why do they all do that? Wine rack. I don't know why you have a wine rack because we don't keep wine long enough to keep it in a rack. So you could live, I'll say you could live in one of these easily, couldn't you? You really could. Beautiful van. Yeah, give us the camera because I know you don't like holding it, do you? Great caravan. Really is. And uh, I don't know, just Me, just, uh, just under a half price of a motor home. I was just thinking that. I mean, you could pay up to £50,000 for a car to pull it to, to get to the same price of what these motorhomes are. 86,000 it would be. Yeah, yeah, that's very true, yeah. yeah. You could have the top of the range car. And this. And you could go on any site. Or, well, yeah. Drop your car around and you've got a car. Yes. If you're that way inclined. Twin axle, 7.86 metres, 2.45 width. So is that 8 foot? Yeah. It is, isn't it? 8 foot. Yeah. And can't you, uh, is it 8 foot? Yeah. 
Yeah, lovely. Beautiful van. I'm sure it is. Come on, the music stops. I'll show them the outside. Okay. Come okay, on. What's that? What is are you looking at? one next door. I like pink. Does anybody know I like pink? <laughs> Shut up, Lynn. Okay. It's one of them days, folks. It's one of them days. It's a bit high. This room. Bloody hell, you're right. Yes, no, it eight, is a bit high. Eight foot wide. Yeah, eight foot wide. Nice man, very nice man. This one looks different. It's we can't cool. get in it because it's locked. You can, yes. I mean, no, it's an Ariba, which normally the Aribas we've looked at are that size. Yes, about that size, but yeah. This one is huge. Twin yeah. axle. Is there a price on it? Nice one. Please ask to view for more information. Not even a price. Not a price. So it's got to be expensive, isn't it? I'd say so. It looks expensive. But we're not going to ask if we can have a look in because we'll be wasting people's time because we're not interested in buying it. That's right. So when and we don't dealing, like, dealing with other customers. Yeah, we don't like wasting people's time, so it's pointless. Let's have a look at this little oh it's sold. That one's sold. I like I like different things, I do I love it. Yeah, that's why. Go on, say it, that's why you married me. Certainly different, isn't you? Oh base camp. We weren't doing swift pots. Please be open, base camp. Of course it will be. Please. Da, 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 da. Yay! Yay. <laughs> I love these things. Look at the space in there. I've got to get in this. Can you hold that? I can. Because I've hurt my knee for some reason. I don't even know if I'll get in. Oh, I'll watch this. Come on, give me a hand. Yay! It's a long way back down. This is going to be interesting seeing me get back down. You're not going to see me get back down. Yeah. I mean, what more could you want than this little base camp? Loads of storage. Storage bags there. Massive skylight. A little table there. Loads of seating. Which turns into a bed. More storage there. You've got your control panel there, whale. TV point there, so you could put your TV on here, I suppose. What's in here? Storage with a table for outside. Or you could put a table in here, I suppose. Yeah. You've also little mirror there, look. And you've got a wet room with loads oh, of room. I was just going Great to, sink. I was just going to say, I wonder if those are travel seats. There's something wrong with you. Oh, I forgot I was in a caravan. There's something, something <laughs> seriously a matter with you. It is. I mean, look at the amount of worktop you've got. <laughs> look. It's just, they're just, I just love the things. What's in here? There you look. go, a little cup in your door, look. And I love those. That's a fantastic idea. Brilliant, brilliant idea. That comes up more, doesn't it? Yeah, I just didn't want to force it, Robert. Yes, that's fantastic. I don't fantastic. know, I'll, they should go in all the vans, all of them. And I totally agree. And I don't usually agree with you, do I? No, you don't. But yeah, cracking fridge. It's just awesome. I love the things. Uh-oh, what are you doing? I didn't fix that. Uh-oh, uh-oh, she broke it. I haven't broke it. That goes. Can you stop messing with things? I don't break. I just look. We shouldn't look. Remember? Look at your eyes, not your hands. It's <laughs> great. How much is it? This price look on there. It is twenty-three thousand four hundred and ninety. It's not a thousand. No, it's not fifteen hundred pound off. It was twenty-four thousand nine nine ninety. Nine nine ninety. And now it's twenty-three and a half grand. Yes. Twenty-three four nine zero. Oh, yes. Yeah, twenty-three and a half. So look, it is really nice. This is the nicest base camp I've been in. And I love it when they put the awnings on the back. Yes. The huge awnings. Yes, because we've seen them on site. So you open this door here and they put a massive awning on the back. I've got to get down. Oh, I'm down. Yeah, so I put a massive awning on there so it comes out to about here. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Come here. <sighs> Bloody hell, you movie. I'm going to shut the door because I don't trust this wind. Great things. Is that brand new? 
I'm gonna have a look see if it's brand new. We can put one of these on the back of the motor home for you. Yeah, happy with that. Is it? Is it you? Base camp two? I don't know if it's new, maybe it is new. I don't know. I'd say it's new for that much money, would you? Yeah. Huh? What's the matter? Nothing, I'll just say hello. Oh. There's people about, she's gonna be choy. Oh, shut up. <laughs> so, the last one we're gonna look in today is the Swift Elegance Grande 760, brand new, uh, eight foot wide. For 38,990 was 43,990. Beautiful looking van, very modern looking. It's only, Swift. It's only a single. And you can't get it. <laughs> Scrap that one. <laughs> Unbelievable. Very spoilt, my wife is. Very spoilt. Lunch out again. Is it nice? It is beautiful. I haven't had a jacket potato for ages. Bloody lovely that was, folks. It really, really, really was, and I didn't cook it. Uh, somebody just bought Airstream there, look. Lovely. Very nice. And we've just bought our daughter a cup. 25 because quid I've just spent on a cup. She wanted the Stan she bought the Stanley one off Amazon, the same as ours. We've we got to walk there, Um But you can't seal it. Like you can with that, and she works in, as you know in a dog groomer's, so she wanted one for work. So we just bought her a pink mug. She's worth it. I'm going to tell her you said that. No, don't tell her I said that. My right, folks are back in the van. I got my pajamas on, ready for a nice romantic evening. Shut up, rabbit. So, uh, before we go, um, just like to wish Russ Morgan and Trudy Morgan a very happy 15th wedding anniversary. Although she didn't tell me when it was, but to get happy anniversary to both of you. Happy anniversary. Happy anniversary. <laughs> happy anniversary, folks. Hope you have a fantastic anniversary and a lovely meal out and perhaps a romantic night. <sighs> yes. Anyway, I hope you've enjoyed our trip to Loudoun's. We've we've enjoyed it, haven't we? Yeah, yeah. If you're, you know, seriously into motor homes and caravans and things like we are, it's a great place to visit, to be honest. Even if you're not and you're just interested, it's a great place to visit. And it's better than going to somewhere like the NEC because you can actually go in all the vans and sit and really think about, about it before you spend a ton of money. You can't sit in all the vans, some of them are locked. Well, you just ask for the keys if you're interested in it. Yeah, the more expensive range, you have to go in and ask for, because it's supervised. Uh, it's just so you people... Supervised, what is it? Visit. Supervised. No. What's the word? I don't know, anyway. Yeah, so if you are interested in one of the, the top end ones, you just go and ask for the keys and they will open it for you. And supervised it. viewing. Oh, he's got the word. Yes! Yes! Right, we're going to end it now because this video has gone on and on and on, a lot like somebody we know. Anyway. Yeah, look, you're ready Robert, I just, I'm, I just feel rubbish. Yes, all she wants to do now really is to get a kit off. I just want to get my jammers on and get some food and that's it. And we'll get back, get back tomorrow. Yes. Yeah. <sighs> We have really enjoyed it, people. We hope you have too. If for some strange reason you come across our channel. Yes, please don't forget to give us a like. Um, drop us a comment. We always answer all of you. And please subscribe if you haven't already done so. We do appreciate that. It helps our channel grow. <laughs> Love it. Quarter to six here now at the moment on Saturday night. So, yeah, come on. So, so on that note, people, we will say a farewell. So stay safe in the cavern as my drone is tend to subscribe on you. We still love you. We do. Thank you so much for watching. We will see you on the next one. In a bit. <sighs> that wasn't too bad. Did I? <laughs> <coughs> you made me choke. <laughs>